Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Kelvin Johnson. In this short video, I want to show you how to assign an Office 365 license to a user from your Microsoft 365 Admin Center. Let's say you've been asked from in your company or you want to assign a license, an E3 license, E5 license, E1 license to a user. So it is actually very easy to do that from your Admin Center. First of all, you need to log on to your admin.microsoft.com or you can log on to your office.com and click admin which will take you to your admin center. Here we have the users and we have the active users. So on the active user, we can see we have users with different licenses. So we have like um, Thomas Johnson who does not have a license at the moment. You can see it says the license says unlicensed. So we just click on Thomas Johnson account. And on Thomas Johnson account, you can see we have the account devices, license and apps, mail and OneDrive. So we're actually interested in the license and apps. So click on the license and apps here. Definitely, you may have different options of license which you can assign to a user if you work for a company. And also, we have other options we can decide to add here. Sometimes if your company have some other free license like the Microsoft Teams uh, free license and some other license which can be assigned to users. So here we have two options. We have the E5, uh, Microsoft 365 E5 and the Office 365 E5. These are actually two different kind of licenses because they, they both have different option, options and the prices are actually different. So if for, for example, user who are using the Office 365 E5 does not have the license of Microsoft Intune included in it. But if you assign the license of Microsoft 365 E5, the user will have um, access to the um, Microsoft Intune and Azure P2. So I'm going to assign this user a Microsoft 365 license. And here you can see all the options the user is going to have. It's like what I just said, the Azure Active Directory P2. And also we have the Azure Right Management. So if you scroll down, you can see all the different options that the user have. Also, we have Microsoft Intune as well. So I'm going to just click Save, click Save Changes. So you can see your changes have been saved. And then when I click Close, you can see that the license has been assigned to Thomas Johnson. And mind you, this license take effect immediately. So when Thomas log on to um, to his Windows 10 device and registered, um, for example, on Office 365 apps, automatically um, it will be registered. Thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video. My name is Kelvin Johnson. And please, if this video have been of any help to you, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also to give me a thumb up for taking my time to create this video. Thank you very much and see you next time. Bye.